Hi, I'm playing a Blitz game online today. This is a quick test, uh, just to see what it's like to play chess um, uh, online and to comment on the on the game while I'm playing. It's a pretty strange move. What is he trying to get out of this? can't really break through like this, can he? The, the pin is a little irritating, but I don't really think it's a very big deal. Uh, because at any time I can probably just chop on e5 or do something. And, and once I castle and get rid of the pin, the time he spends setting up the pieces on that diagonal would probably be no better than wasted. Um, oh, I can I can probably play knight to d4 next move, and well, maybe he responded because of that. Well, that's very consistent. What are you gonna do against that? And when all the pieces come in, what's gonna happen then? Uh, I can do this shit. And now I can maybe try to win the rook, right? Let's see. It looks promising for sure. That rook on a1 is hanging, as you can tell. Well, I guess there's something I overlooked as well. Uh, well, I guess I'll just play down the exchange now. plan has fallen down, so I guess we know who blundered in that situation. The knight on e4 is still, is still doing fairly strong to be fair, and I still should be able to break through with c5. And um, I mean, I'm a little worried about him playing g4 and stuff. I'm also a little worried about me not having castled. That pair of bishops should be compensating for something, but I'm not sure what for. Take with the pawn, take with the bishop, take with the bishop. Uh, it's probably in my best interest to maintain a little bit of tension here and just to build up some pressure. Well, I guess he'll play bishop to a3, that is really annoying. Can he do that? Maybe. Maybe he can't. So he does not. I guess I have to do something about that. Win now. Some threatening mate on g2. All of a sudden, does he have anything better than rook f2? He does have queen f2 as well. It's loosey goosey a little bit because it hangs his. Um, so he does that. No, I don't have a single threat. I can still probably regroup and play rook c2 at some point. So my next play is queen b5 and then rook c2. That should do me good. Probably queen to c4 was a bit better. So that bishop there is, you know, it is worth uh, almost a full rook. It's a little... Um, so he's probably regrouping for... Rook c1, but my goal is not to let that happen. I guess he can now play rook to c2, then I go rook to b... Rook to c4. I'm really running out of rooks here, that's the the ultimate diagnosis, I guess. He's defended well, and what am I gonna do? I'll just try to make a cheap threat. 
the threat now is really to take to take on d4 and I'm not really too terrified of his giving me check because mostly because I can't really avoid that um, and I am running out of moves here a little bit should I be worried about this I should have taken that rook and he should have taken I should have taken the darn rook again this is really silly ladies and gentlemen and now what I don't have very much I really can't seem to stop mate can I G5 Check Miraculously I had not been made it Check uh, so I have to run Check I have to run Check I have to run I don't know how the heck I escaped because it seemed completely impossible on the surface uh, so now those checks are really bugging me uh, I should make a move that would surprise him I don't see what he does against this check yeah well I got lucky in this one thanks for watching